Longtime plans for museum expansion have brought many gathering at the Newport Beach Nautical Museum this evening. Explore Ocean, the latest exhibit, is being revealed tonight. Designed to inspire a whole new generation of ocean-going exploration, a team of award-winning designers is creating a world-class interactive experience that puts an entire ocean of discovery in your grasp. This is Explore Ocean. Explore Ocean is really going to be the gateway to ocean adventure. We've just completed our initial design of the new facility and the programming, what the visitor will experience in Explore Ocean. Ocean Explorer Christopher Welsh has partnered with Richard Branson and the Newport Beach Nautical Museum to launch Virgin Oceanic, traveling to depths of the ocean that have never been seen by human eyes. The data they gather will be brought right back here to Newport Beach, among other locations. My project is to take a submarine to the deepest place in each of the five ocean basins. So we're going to go around the world with the sub and dive all the deep places, and that's the five dives mission. We'll probably do 25 or 30 dives in the course of it because it's pretty incredible to have a sub that can go literally anywhere. And there's lots of things I want to see. So as we cruise along, we're going to go down and see what's there. We'll get down to the bottom in two hours and 20 minutes as opposed to five and a half hours. Once there, have 10 kilometers of range. We know virtually nothing about what's down there. Um, and there's going to be fantastic things found. One cup sample of sediment brought back on another mission yielded 400 new life forms. The, the deep places, we're going to bring back sampling and such of, of microbial life and small critters and that kind of thing. Semi-predictable, but it has a lot of science value and a lot of medicinal value. We're, we're kind of doing something new, which is an, sort of an open source approach where all the sampling we bring back and the knowledge will be disseminated. And people do their own research after that. But the raw material of the research, we're going to try and share with everybody. We have. Uh, relationships with all the top oceanographic institutions, from Scripps to Woods Hole, uh, Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Institute, uh, University of Alaska, University of Hawaii. We're doing the expensive part of, of ocean research for them, so it's opening up a lot for the researchers. Atlantic Coast is a place where in eight or 9,000 feet of water, 20,000 tons of chemical munitions were dumped after World War II. That's an immense amount of chemical munitions all rotting away. That's the kind of thing that ought to be shown to the world so that it's something will get done about it. I'm going to try and do something that's never been done before, which is to uh, put a sonar tag on a sperm whale, and the sub's fast enough to stay up with them, and track it down where it feeds on the giant squid, and which is, the giant squid's 50 feet long, so that's pretty overwhelming to contemplate. They're aggressive, the, the sperm whales come back with, with tooth marks from the squid, so it's a, it's a big fight. And that'd be, no one's ever seen a giant squid alive, so it'd be incredible to, to film that. As Explore Ocean develops, it's going to become more of a, a place for, for people to come down and get inspired. Um, one of the pet projects I'm hoping they'll have is, is a sort of live tracking of explorers around the world. And, you know, no one, there is no museum of exploration right now. So if you give 10 or 15 explorers that are really doing things a venue to show what they're doing, it's great for them, it's great for people coming here to get inspired and see what's going on. A 4D simulated theater will allow viewers to experience the most memorable moments of the explorers. Real footage will be seen on a 360 degree screen using state of the art technology. The simulated ride will capture the senses with surround sound and scent dispersal. What specific changes do you expect to bring to the museum that other museums don't have? I think it's the interactive element and the educational element, combining those two together. It's fun, they know it's going to be fun, but at the same time they're having fun, they're going to be learning about things that they never even knew about what's above and below the surface of the ocean. They're going to find an amazing world down here that they didn't even know existed. You can actually touch the live sea hares, or the sea stars, sea urchins, and the many other creatures here in this sustainable habitat. Well, I think Explore Ocean is going to be something that people are going to know, not only in Newport Beach and Orange County, but all over the country. It's, it's going to be a world-class attraction. We're going to show the oceans in a way that no one's ever seen before.